What's up, YouTube? Soon! Oh, like here. And today, you guys, we have one of the amazing, the epic, the Yu-Gi-Oh! The Dark Side of Dimensions, first edition booster boxes. And hopefully we get some awesome pulls, and then I want to ask you guys to check out the channel and subscribe for some more epic Yu-Gi-Oh! videos. Alright, you guys, so a lot of you guys have been asking to uh, see another box opening of The Dark Side of Dimensions, the newest movie pack box. And so here it is, and this box actually has been increasing in value, so... Uh, you guys may want to pick one up and just uh, hold on to it and see what happens. But yeah, pretty interesting. And for this video, you guys, we're going to check out the different cubic monsters. The uh, evil guy. I actually have tried my best not to look up a review or a summary of the movie or watch the uh, subbed version to, uh, you know, enjoy the dubbed version much more with the original voice actors. So I'm looking forward to that. But yeah, so I'm guessing it's the Evil Guys cards, the Cubic Monsters. And uh, yeah, so we're going to check those out today. The Cubic deck's pretty interesting. It can OTK pretty easily. And uh, OTK means one turn kill, for those that have not heard the name before. So we're going to pop these packs open. And thanks to our friends at Ultra Pro, we have this beautiful uh, Nian Cat playmat here. And then we'll be using some black sleeves. Uh, I think they're a Ninja Nian Cat. Look at that. There we go. Alright, you guys, first pack here for this epic movie pack box. It's nice. Starting strong with the Dark Magician, and I've never actually seen a box with a playset of all alternative or blue eyes alternative white dragons. So that'd be interesting. The ultimate wizard in terms of attack and defense. Ooh, starting off with the uh, Cuban Nova Trinity, the Dark Cubic Lord. So this guy is insane, and we'll talk about him a little later. He's kind of like the final form. Uh, Dimension Reflector. And then Unification of the Cubic Lords. So, I'll figure those cards out here. But we're going to sleeve up the uh, the Trinity. Nova Trinity, the Dark Cubic Lord. I'm going to sleeve that guy out. Alright, next pack. The uh, Metal Hold, the Moving Blockade. Kiwi Magician Girl. Uh, Gandor X, the Dragon of Demolition. Demolution. Clear Karibo. And Vulcan Dr Dragna. Dragby, the Cubic King. So there's the Cubic King. And these decks are based, the Cubic decks kind of based on the seed. And I'll, when I pull the seed, I'll show you guys. Nice, the Dark Magician Girl. Pretty card. Uh, Gira, the Ghoul. Gwil, the Cubic King. The Cubic King. Uh, cubic Mandala. And a Slifer the Sky Dragon. And then Crimson Nova the Cubic Dark Cubic Lord. Okay. So that guy goes with the other Cubic Lord there. The nice Slifer the Sky Dragon Dark Magic Girl. I know this box is going to be a little more about the Cubic Monsters this time because we've already opened it. And I love the Slifer. I love the Dark Magician Girl. But they've gotten their showtime. Alright, you guys. So we got to check out this guy first. He is insane. Uh, cannot be normal summoner set, but must be special summoner of your hand by revealing three other cubic cards, not cubic monsters. So you can have the uh, cubic traps and magics too. That's why this guy's crazy. And uh, they have to be different names though, and you special summon this guy, and he's unaffected by other monsters' activated effects. And whose original attack is 3,000 or less. When attacking, and this card destroys a monster by battle, you can activate this effect. This card can make a second attack during that battle phase. And during the end phase, each player takes 3,000 damage. Wow. Can you only use that effect once per turn? So this guy's crazy. He can attack twice. At the end of the turn, you do 3,000 damage. This guy wins games, basically. And you can just special summon him by having multiple. And to go with that guy, you have the, uh, the Dark Cubic Lord. And it takes three of him. The Nova Dark Cubic Lord. This guy's the Nova Trinity. So it takes three of those guys. Three 3,000 beat sticks. And then this guy can be attacked, or sorry, when he declares an attack, half your opponent's life points. So, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's start by halving your opponent's life points. And then when it destroys a monster by battle, you can activate this effect. This card can make a second attack. Wow. And if you take effect damage, inflict damage to the damage you took to your opponent. Crazy card there. So there's one, like, OTK right there is just you having three of those guys and using polymerization and summoning that guy and that guy just wins the game sometimes by himself because he has the life points and then he can make another attack so 
doing easy 8,000 damage just with those cards alone. And then uh, Unification of the Cubic Lords, as it says in the name there. Uh, this is kind of the trap card polymerization for the Cubic deck. And here's Cubic Wave. This card's cool and also works with those OTKs. Target one Cubic Monster you control, one face-up monster your opponent controls. The attack of that monster you control becomes double, and then your opponent's monster becomes half. Crazy. Then it also has uh, a way of putting on Cubic Counters, which negates... And oh baby! Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragon. But uh, what I was saying is Cubic Counters can negate your opponent's monster's effects, and they can't attack. And this, so that card can put Cubic Counters on the monsters. But wow, okay. This box is already very good. We got a Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragon. Oh man. And then here is the Cubic Karma. And this uh, has to do with the Cubic Seed. Sending you a number of the Cubic Seeds for your hand deck to the graveyard, and then that monster gains 800 attack. And then you could Special Summon Seeds. So it's basically a way of pumping your monsters and putting Cubic cards from your deck to your hand. And then here is the Cubic Behemoth. He's the big guy over there. We'll talk about him later. Very awesome. Silver Gadget, another good card. Those gadgets are actually pretty, pretty, uh, probably going to go up in value. Uh, cubic Form. No, really? <laughs> Too much cubes. Uh, chaos Form. Magical Contract Door, Dark Horizon, Unification, and Assault Wyvern. So Chaos Form goes with the Ultimate Blue Eyes. Or the Dragon Guy. Pandemic Dragon. Blue Eyes White Dragon. A Legendary Dragon is a powerful engine of destruction, virtually invincible. Only this guy has faced the awesome creature and lived to tell the tale. Cubic Rebirth. Blue Eyes White Dragon. So let's see if we can get another alternative Blue Eyes White Dragon. Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragon. Another Nova Trinity. And Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragon. That's what the Nova Trinity was for. Lord Gaia, Apple Magician, and Lemon Magician. Another Cubic Beast. Final Gius, Dragon's Finding Spirit. Dark Genex, the Cubic Beast. So the mini Cubic Beast. So we got all three cubic beasts. Now we're looking to get the fairies. We're missing one. The four star. Alright, counter gay dog. Magician the ultimate wizard in terms of attack and defense. Cubic karma again. Paladin the Oracle Mahad. Somewhat of a useful card for those dark magician decks. Magician's defense. Chocolate Magician Girl. There we go. Oh, baby. Getting one of her. She's a very nice card. Very good for those Spellcaster decks. Once per turn, you can discard a Spellcaster type monster and draw one card. Pretty good. And once per turn, this card is targeted for attack. You can special summon cards. So. Very cool. Deep Eyes White Dragon. It's crazy how every card in here is ultra rare. It's pretty sweet. Kaiser Voice Raider, Dark Horizon, Berry Magician Girl, Silver Gadget, and Induced Explosion. And just about halfway through, you guys. Here we go. Ooh, another Dark Magician Girl. The Dark Magician Girl. Oh, uh, there he is. A Vijam. I don't know exactly how to say that, but yeah. The Cubic Seed. So this guy is actually pretty good. And if this was like a few years back, this guy would be just amazing by himself. So we'll check him out in a minute. Another Dark or dark Veil, and then the Cubic Lord again. So we got two of those guys now. Hopefully we get three to make the Trinity. But another Dark Magician Girl, that's really good. Two Dark Magician Girls in one box. I don't know if I've done that before. Or if we've done that before. Alright, let's check out the Cubic Seed before we get to the left side here. Uh, cannot be destroyed by battle. At the end of the damage step, this card battle an opponent's monster. You can place this card in your spell or trap card zone as a continuous spell. And if you do, place a Cubic Counter. Cube counter on opponent's monster means they don't have an effect and they cannot attack. So it's pretty crazy. And during your main phase, you can special summon this card from the spell and trap card zone. Wow. So a uh, really good card. Like that would be very useful in many different decks. And it's dark too. A few years back. But I mean I know now it's more about, you know, OTKing your opponent and just doing a whole bunch of shenanigans, shenanigans as quick as possible. But when 
Creature was just kind of attacking to gain control, you know, one at a time kind of thing. That card would have been broken. Uh, Metal Hole, Dimension Guardian, Garuba again. And then Buster G Gundle. So the seed is the starting point. It's the seed, the cubic seed. It makes sense, you know what I mean? You gotta plant the seed first. Blue Eyes White Dragon again. Nice box. The legendary dragon. Neo Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. Nice. Blue Eyes White Dragon, Blue Eyes White Dragon, and Blue Eyes White Dragon. Dimension Mirage. No way! Oh, baby, the insanity. It is a double Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragon box. Oh, baby. Wow. Incredible. We actually pulled two in one box. I think we did that one other time. That is awesome. <laughs> this box is amazing. Two Alternative uh, White Dragons. And then there's two regular Blue Eyes White Dragons. That's pretty sweet. And we're getting all these cool Cubic cards. Clear Karibo. Okay. Can we actually get a playset of the alternative Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragons? That would be godly, you guys. I've never seen it done. Let's do it. Right here, right now. And the final cubic card. Nice. A third Dark Magician Girl. What? A playset of Dark Magician Girls. Wow. Two Sly for the Sky Dragons. This is definitely a godly box. I was trying to give the cubics a little more showtime here. But what am I supposed to do when I'm pulling three Dark Magician Girls in one box? Definitely have not done that before. That is insane. Wow. And there's another God card too. Wow. Definitely a magical box we got going on here. Three Dark Magician Girls. Alright you guys, so for the Cubic Beast, they're pretty sweet. Um, basically... Each of them can search out the next one in line. So you start with the Garnex, then the Garuda, and then you get the Gundle. And uh, they're pretty sweet. This one can attack once, and then when it destroys the opponent's monster by battle, it can search it can search out the next guy and then bring out two seeds from the grave. And that's how each of these cubic cards work. They bring back the seeds from the grave, and then you can use them as fodder or tribute to special summon the next one in line. And so basically that's how it works. And then this guy can attack twice with 2,000 attack, and this guy can attack three times with 3,000 attack. So they're pretty fun cards, that's for sure. The thing is with these ones though, you do have to destroy monster as a result of battles. So it's a little bit picky, but attacking three times for 3,000 is pretty insane. And then come the uh, Cubic Kings. And the Cubic Kings, they deal 800 damage instead of being able to attack multiple times. They deal 800 damage when they come into play. And it's a little bit easier to get them out. But still, pretty cool cards. And uh, when this one's destroyed by an opponent's card effect or or uh, battle, it comes out, you can bring out three cubic monsters. So, pretty insane. But they only gain those attack points if they're special summoned by cubic effects, by their cubic effect. So, the seed brings out all those guys. So they're pretty cool cards, fun to play with for sure, and there's definitely some OTK possibilities. So, interesting cards. The cubic fairies and the cubic beasts. Alright, gold gadget, another dark... What?! Is that a play set of Dark Magicians and Blue Eyes White Dragons? What is going on? Alright you guys, I've never seen anything like this for one of these movie pack boxes. You've got to see this. Three Dark Magician Girls, three Blue Eyes White Dragons, and three Dark Magicians. Holy crap! That is crazy. What? And two Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragons. If we can actually get a play set of those, man. And like I said, I've never seen that before. What is going on right now? We still have half left side left. Let's do this, you guys. Another Chaos Max Dragon. A Trinity of Trinity Lords. Silver Gadget. Cubic Beast. Come on, you guys. Heart of the cards. Let's get three Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragons. Here we go. Cubic Wave. An Avatar. Counter Gate. Bear Magician Girl. Salt Wyvern. Apple Magician Girl. Oh, 
baby, a playset, you guys. No way. No way. No. What just happened? This is the godliest box. The best box I've ever seen of the Yu-Gi-Oh! Dark Side of Dimensions movie pack. What? A playset of Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragons in one box. What is going on? I don't even think I pulled one in my first box. You guys, this is godly. What? Like, literally, we have three Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragons. We can make the Blue Eyes ultimate alternative white dragon <laughs> out of this box what is going on oh baby you guys this is crazy all right three packs left um we got what i don't even know i try i tried to keep the cubics in the spotlight but it doesn't look like it's gonna happen i'm sorry whoa 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 three blue eyes alternative white dragons Dang, another Dark Magic Veil, too. I think we almost got a play set of those. And that's three Chaos Max Dragons, too. Oh, my God. And Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. What a pack there, you guys. A Chaos Max and a Blue Eyes Ultimate. And the final pack of Destiny. I don't even know what we could get to make this box any better. Let's go for a third God card so we get a play set of Slifers. Kaiba! Ooh. Oh, we got three Nova the Dark Cubic Lords, though. There's our Trinity. Another gold gadget, too. That's a good pack. Wow, you guys. All right, let's do a little recap. Are you guys ready for this epic, this insane, this godly recap of this amazing booster box? Probably the best box I think I've ever seen of uh, Dark Side of Dimensions. This is crazy, you guys. I don't even know how this happened. I was trying to talk about the cubic cards, but uh, wow. <laughs> a real quick before the recap, though, just a couple cards we didn't really talk about ever from all these box openings. Um, the Pandemic Dragon. It's actually a 2500 Dark 7 Star Dragon. So that's pretty bad but its effect is cool once per turn you can pay life points and multiples of 100 other face up monsters on the field lose that much attack once per turn you can target one monster on the field with attack less than this or less than or equal to this card and destroy it if this card destroys if this card is destroyed by battle or card effect all face up monsters on the field lose 1000 attack this card would, would have been extraordinary back in the day but once again you know, I know the game's a little too fast for cards like this now, maybe. But still, that's insane. Like, if you get this guy out, and then you have ways to special summon more dragons, and you just pay 3,000 life points, and all your opponent's monsters become zero, and you can just win the game. And, uh, obviously, before you bring out your other monsters, because you don't want them to lose attack. And then you guys, it doesn't say until end of turn. Those monsters actually lose attack forever. So, uh, yeah. And then you could destroy monsters, too. So that's, that's pretty cool. I, <laughs> that would be amazing. Like before but yeah now it's just kind of like okay and then grandora or gandora x the dragon of demolition you know this is one of this is yugi's dragon kind of thing and uh when this card's normal or special summon from the hand you can destroy as many other monsters on the field as possible and if you do inflict damage to your opponent equal to the highest original attack of those monsters this card's attack becomes equal to the damage dealt to your opponent and then once per turn during your end phase half your life points I just thought that was interesting though. Pretty cool card. And as you guys can see here, I have all the cubic cards out here. We got those cubics, magic and traps. You got the, uh, the beast cubics right there. And remember those are based off attacks. And if you attack and destroy your opponent's monster, um, you can bring out the next, sp uh, next stage up through the cubic seeds. And then if those destroy monsters, next step up. And they can attack twice and then three times for the 3000 behemoth. It's pretty cool. Definitely a very fun deck. And then uh, the Cubic Kings or the Fairies, they just deal 800 damage when they come into play, and they're very consistent and a little easier to get out than the Beasts. 
And then of course you have the amazing, the dark cubic Lords. And we got three of those in here. And those cards are brilliant because they can just obliterate your opponent's life points in one turn. And you can bring it out using just half showing three cubic cards in your hand and the cubic cards include the magic and traps. So, um, and then of course Trinity just to, this guy just straight wins a game when he comes out. So, and that's three of those. And yeah, just need polymerization three of those. Maybe you can use Swamp King. So, yeah, now for the other cards that I didn't plan on, and then of course the seed, like I said, is the requirement kind of to go through all those cards. And now for the cards, yeah, that I didn't really plan on uh, going through because we've gone through them before, but the godliness of this box, you guys, was just overwhelming. Insane. We actually got three Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragons. I, I said in the beginning kind of as a, just a passing thing because I've never seen it happen before. But it actually happened. We got a playset, you guys, of Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragons. What in the world? And that's not all. That's not where it stops. That's the thing. You're like, dang, that's amazing. You know, we got three of those. But no. Three Dark Magician Girls. How many times have you seen that? I never, I've never seen that. Three Blue Eyes White Dragons. What? Three Dark Magicians. Now you're just like, ha, ah, you're, you're funny. No. And then three, Blue Eyes Chaos Max Dragons. <laughs> what just happened? And then we've got a couple Dark Veils, couple Slifers, Neo Galaxies, Neo Galaxies, Neo Eyes, Neo Eyes, Blue Eyes, Neo Eyes, Ultimate Dragons. And then we got two and three Silver Gadgets, but we only did get one Chocolate Mission Girl. It's just, you're trying to find a reason to cool off a little bit, I guess that's a reason, but wow. Unbelievable. Let's take out those play sets. The insanity, you guys. What a box. I cannot believe we actually got three Blue Eyes Alternative White Dragons. Wow. Look at this epicness, you guys. That is insane. And once again, you guys, thanks for watching. And thank you for telling me to open up another movie pack, Dark Side Dimensions booster box. Because this was the best box I think you could get. <laughs> What just happened? Thanks for watching and simply, oh, lucky, signing out.